The scattering is one of the most important tools of Bagapai, and it has recently been remade from the ground up. The scatters created by the current version are not compatible with the previous ones, and vice versa. First of all, remember to apply the scale of your surface. Ctrl A and apply scale. Select one or more assets and select the surface. The last object selected, example the active object, will be the one that will receive the scatter. Among the important parameters is the min distance, which determines the minimum distance between two trees. Density max defines the numbers of points per square meters. Keep the density as low as possible to improve performance. After having created the first scatter layer, you can add an asset to this layer by selecting it and selecting the surface with the scatter layer to which you want to add it. It can also be removed the same way. You can add as many scatter layers as you want. Don't forget to rename the layers to avoid confusing them. There is a texture system, attention, its precision depends on the density of vertices of the surface. If necessary, subdivide the surface. This is also valid for paint, point effector and camera calling. The factor increases the influence of the texture on the layer. You can invert the texture. You can also synchronize the parameters of several textures with a driver. A driver is used to synchronize one value with another. Copy the value as a new driver and paste it into the value to be synchronized. You can delete the driver if needed. Right click delete. You can also paint assets. Select the assets you want to paint with. Select the surface and paint. The paint can be reset or inverted, and the brush can add or remove particles. All layers have the same paint system. You can also enable proxies. They will temporarily replace instances with lighter versions. These proxies won't show up on rendering. You can add an effector point. The object will influence the number of instances near its faces. Select the object that will serve as an effector. Select the surface and the scatter layer to influence. The distance is used to modify the zone of influence of the faces. It can be assigned to several layers by repeating the same operation. Camera calling is available. It allows to display only the instances visible by the camera. Select the camera, the surface, and a scatter layer. When camera calling is present, a button appears and allows you to activate it or not in all scatter layers. You can adjust the ratio and the offset of the camera. In the case where the scattering produces a layer that is too heavy, Pagapi proposes to add a proxy directly and to display only part of it, in the viewport only. You can adjust the scattering preferences in the add-on preferences. It is advised to not directly edit the Bagapai collections, and not to apply the scatter modifier. If you want to apply the modifier, we advise you to watch the video linked in the description.